So in the previous video we installed the Astra theme and we created a Chai theme. You've probably noticed that an Astra option appeared here in the sidebar. First, uh, let me just remove these default themes. It's always a good idea to delete unused themes and plugins. Let's go to Astra and let's check out the dashboard. Okay, so here on the welcome page, we have some quick settings. So we can access these functionalities right away. So these are basically available from the, from the WordPress customizer. And here you can also see the Astra Pro modules. Right now we cannot activate them because we don't have the Pro plugin installed yet but we will get back here later. Let's go to settings. Here we also have some options that are only available with the Astra Pro plugin. Let's go to performance and let's activate this option. This one as well and click flush local font files. Okay, so with this option, we can load Google fonts locally from our website and as Astra says this is a good way to improve the performance of your website. So under starter templates, there are a lot of starter templates available for Astra, uh, but to install them, we need to install a plugin temporarily, but we will check this out in the next uh, video. And finally, here we have some comparison and here we have a comparison table that compares the pro and free version of Astra. As you can see, there are a lot of, a lot of options that are only available in the pro uh, plugin. Okay, so here with the next option, we can open the WordPress customizer. We will get back to this in a, in a bit. Uh, let's check the site builder. So here you can create custom layouts for your website, but Again, these options are only available once we have installed the Astra Pro plugin. So right now we are not able to use this functionality, but I wanted to show you that with these, you can basically control the look and the feel of your website and actually every part of your website. So here you can create custom headers, custom footers, we can design custom uh, blog post pages. Uh, if you install WooCommerce, then you will have an option to customize the parts of the WooCommerce website, the checkout, the cart page, and so on. So basically, this is a full-blown website customization option. Okay, let's uh, close this for now. And before we go on to check out this uh, spectral link, let's go to pages, add new page. Let's close this and let's just add a title to this page and click publish. Let's go back to WordPress admin, go to settings, reading, and set this page as our homepage. Okay, let's create a navigation menu as well. Let's call this main menu and assign it to the primary menu location. Click create and let's just add these two pages for now. And if you come back to the uh, page we just created and uh, you click here this plus button then you have a lot of options already that you can use to build your, your page here. But we will install the Spectra plugin, which is free, and it will add a lot more options uh, to this section. So let's go back to the admin area. Let's go to Astra and Spectra. And from here we can install this plugin. The Spectra plugin is basically a page builder or rather it just adds a, a bunch of new blocks to the Gutenberg block editor that we can use to build 
are pages. Uh, by the way, the Spectra is also developed by the same team uh, that created the Astra theme. So you can expect the uh, same uh, quality from them. So let's click uh, Install Spectra and it's installing it and it activated the plugin. And now we are redirected to the plugin page. If you go to Blocks Extensions, then you can see a lot of new modules are available. If there are blocks that you don't normally use, I recommend deactivating them. So for example, I am not going to use star ratings, so I'm just going to deactivate it. You can see that there are some pro modules that are only available if you purchase the Spectra Pro plugin, but by default, already provides a lot of features. And if we go back to pages and click edit again, now you can see that you have some quick settings here. And if you click the plus button, you can see that you have a lot of Spectra related uh, blocks here. And uh, one of the most important, I think, is the container. So you can create your pages by, by creating specific sections. So if I click here, I can create a one column section, a two column section, a three column section, or I can use any of these grid types here. So if I just uh, click the one column section, then it adds it here. And immediately I have access to the settings of this section and I can change its uh, its options here. I can change the width, con uh, the content box width, the height, uh, and so on. Under the style tab, I can change the background color. I can um, change the text color inside this uh, uh, section. I can change the border. I can add box shadows. As you can see, it's basically the same concept that other page builders use. You just need to get used to it. It looks a little bit different than, uh, for example, Elementor or the Divi Builder, if you used them before. But um, once you start working with it, it actually makes sense. And um, I, I kind of like it better now than other page builders. And of course, it uses the native WordPress functionalities. Uh, which is a great thing because it won't add any additional extra load to your website. Okay, we will come back to this editor and use the different uh, blocks uh, later when we design our pages. So I will show you a lot of new things here. Okay, let's go to check the home page. And if you click the customize icon, you can access the customizer. So basically you can access the customizer from the Astra uh, options. You can also access the customizer from the appearance uh, menu, and you can also access the customizer from the front end. So let me just click here and it will load the WordPress customizer. Okay, so here we can access the default options here. We have a global option for typography, colors, containers, for example. Here you can see that if you have the Astra Pro plugin, then you will have more options here. I think the most important part is the header builder and the uh, footer builder. Both are provided by Astra. And here, again, if you have the Pro version of the plugin, then you will have some extra options here. But by default, with the free version of the theme, you can also use this uh, functionality. You can create really nice headers. And, and we will check this out in one of the upcoming videos. Okay, let's go back to the admin area. And let's install the uh, Astra Pro plugin, go to plugins, add new, upload plugin. So you can't uh, search for the plugin here because this is not 
a free plugin so you need to uh, buy a license first uh, you can buy it from the um, as a theme it costs 49 dollars and uh, you will have access to updates for one year or you can purchase a lifetime license for 199 dollars and you will have access to updates for good and if you purchase the plugin you will receive a link where you can uh, download it and you will have access to your license information as well so i will just uh, upload the plugin now click on install now activate the plugin okay it's activated again if you have unused plugins just delete them we don't really need to leave them here and here i get a notification to activate the plugin so i will just click activate and here you need to paste your license key and then just click activate okay the license is activated and now we have access to all the pro features of the astra theme okay, in the next video we are going to check out the starter templates if you have any questions just please leave a comment below the video and i will try my best to answer as quickly as possible don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel thanks very much